Today, the Kentucky Transportation Cabinet declared a state of emergency to speed up a repair plan for the Panther Creek Bridge in Davis County, Kentucky. Now, the bridge has been closed since August. Tonight, Eyewitness News' Amanda Mueller spoke with neighbors near the bridge to get their reaction on the latest update. Amanda? Shelly, it's good news and bad news for those that live and work near Panther Creek Bridge because while we now know the bridge can be repaired, we also know it will remain closed for another two to three months. It's been kind of rough, especially on the farmers. Uh, they've got big equipment now and trying to get on these country roads. It's kind of a mess to try to do it. Wednesday, neighbors in this farming community learned it will be at least two to three more months before Panther Creek Bridge is open for business. And then once we get the steel on site and the contractor on site, uh, you know, we're looking for maybe six to ten weeks. And again, that's maybe plus or minus some because we're still a work in progress here. It's not just heavy farm machinery that has been in a tight squeeze since the bridge closed in August. You got your semis coming in from out of state and they don't see that sign down there too well. And that has resulted in those trucks turning around in driveways. Backing up and turning around. <laughs> and those that do see the signs on time are dealing with a detour that some say is unsafe. They used to say that snakes laid out those roads, you know, they're, they're narrow. And you meet a semi there and he's got to have the road. The idea of the state of emergency and the expedited process is to open the bridge to traffic as soon as possible. Because of the amount of traffic that this bridge carries, we have a lot of commuters that go through there. Uh, we think it's worth the effort to expedite it to try to get it open as quickly as possible. Another neighbor who preferred not to go on camera says the neighborhood has been a bit quieter since the bridge closed. Still, it's safety first for people here who rely on Panther Creek Bridge. Whether it did take us two years, just as long as it make it safe for us. The state of emergency speeds up the time for contractors to bid on the project to 10 days. State officials have not given an estimate on how much it will cost to repair that bridge. Amanda Mueller, Eyewitness News.